Well, hello everyone. Today's video is about these X chocks. We bought these, I'd say about a year after we got our RV, and it's one of the items that we purchased that we do not regret. These chocks are meant to be kind of like setting your parking brake on your RV when you finally get it set to where you want. It helps reduce some of the shake in your RV when you, even when you've got your stabilizers down and everything else going it helps the rock from back and forth and basically all it's doing is putting pressure on both tires and since your tires would need to be moving at two different directions it's locking them in place it's not letting the tires move and they've been great I've had these I use them all the time when we're setting up at an RV park you back into your RV spot and what I usually do is I will put the tongue jack down and figure out exactly how I want everything settled. And before I completely unhook it off the truck, I will install these and they really lock this thing in place. These really do stiffen your RV up pretty good. When you put your jack down, you unhook it from your, your tow vehicle. This trailer doesn't move. They haven't rusted on us. They've, we've had these, like I said, as almost as long as we've had the RV, they haven't rusted. These come in a two pack, uh, basically one for each side. And as you can tell, they're only going to work if you have tandem axles or triple axles. All right, so here's one of the x shocks here. They're very easy to install. This is just a little grab handle. They're very lightweight. I'd probably say, I don't know, five pounds. And you just take it, you slide it in between your tires. This one I did not uh, loosen a lot, but you slide it in between your tires like that. And line them up, make sure they're nice and in the middle. And then you take the wrench and put it there like that's going to be loosening it and you just turn this and it's going to start tightening up i can already start to feel it tightening the tires and again you can tighten this as tight as you want you can put them really tight and it's putting a ton of binding pressure on it but you don't need to put these real tight i mean they they serve their purpose at a medium tightness. Now this wrench does not come with these chocks. It has its own little wrench that's that's pretty much just like this. I actually lost it. So I ended up just picking me one of these up from Home Depot, but it's pretty much just like this, except this is just, it has a rounded end here and it's only meant to have the, the ratchet and closed end. Um, but this is just a three quarter inch Husky ratchet that I got from Home Depot and it works the same way. So that's all you need to do to tighten it down. If you want to loosen them off, you just turn them the other direction and they start coming undone. And it just gets so easy to do that you could just grab it and pull them off. That's it. If you don't currently have a set of these X-Chocks and you have a tandem axle travel trailer or RV, fifth wheel, whatever, and you're interested in getting a set, I'm gonna put a link down in the description underneath this video. But yeah, putting these X-Chocks on, they're just part of our setup and takedown procedure. So these are just second nature now. Hopefully these work good for you too. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you would. It's that red button underneath the video that says subscribe. It's absolutely free and it really helps us out. All right, well, into our next video. Thanks everyone.